This is Rob from Green Aces. And today we're counting down our top 10 most anticipated games of 2024. Starting at number 10, we have Warhammer 40k Space Marine 2, the sequel to the 2011 Space Marine 1. While Space Marine 1 was developed by Relic and published by THQ, Space Marine 2 is now in the hands of Saber Interactive, published by Focus. Saber Interactive, known for titles like the World War Z games, has brought its expertise to the Warhammer universe. Captain Titus, now demoted to lieutenant, undergoes the Rubicon Primaris transformation, evolving into a stronger version. Facing the Tyranids, you fight through Imperial worlds against the Chaos Threat. Expect new squad mates in immersive gameplay. The release is set for September 9th, 2024. At number 9, we have Senua Saga Hellblade 2, the sequel to the 2017 Hellblade, Senua's Sacrifice. Developed by Ninja Theory, now under Microsoft, this game showcases the power of Xbox. The latest trailer, unveiled at the Game Awards, highlights the in-game footage. Ninja Theory, known for games like Heavenly Sword and DMC, promises an intense narrative as we delve deeper into Senua's story. The anticipation is high for the sequel, set to continue the studio's legacy. Release details are yet to be confirmed. Number 8 brings us Stalker 2, part of Cornabile, a sequel to the original Stalker series. Developed by GSC Gameworld, this Ukrainian studio revives the post-apocalyptic Cornabile Exclusion Zone. The game, blending first-person shooter, horror, and immersive sim elements, promises an incredible experience. Facing factions, creatures, and mysteries, you explore the hazardous zone. With a Q1 2024 release window, Stalker 2 is expected to bring back the series' gripping atmosphere. Avowed takes the seventh spot, an action role-playing game set in the universe of Pillars of Eternity. Created by Obsidian Entertainment, now owned by Xbox, this game features the Envoy investigating a mysterious plague in the Living Lands. In a Skyrim-like fashion, Avowed offers a first-person action RPG experience with magic, melee weapons, and firearms. Running on Unreal Engine 5, it represents Obsidian's RPG mastery. The release window extends throughout 2024. At number 6, we have Dragon Age Dreadwolf, developed by BioWare, the creators of iconic RPGs like Mass Effect. Set for a potential 2024 release, this game explores the Dragon Age universe with updated gameplay. Departing from traditional turn-based combat, it introduces a hack-and-slash system. The return of familiar characters and new story elements further builds anticipation. BioWare plans a media blowout next summer, revealing more about this long-awaited sequel. Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League claims the fifth spot. Developed by Rocksteady, known for the Batman Arkham series, this game takes us to Metropolis. Play as Captain Boomerang, Deadshot, Harley Quinn, or King Shark, solo or co-op, in an open-world live service setup. This multiplayer online game offers a unique perspective in the Arkham universe. Scheduled for release on February 2nd, 2024, it promises an engaging experience, both online and offline. Securing the fourth spot is Black Myth Wukong, inspired by the classic Chinese novel Journey to the West. Developed by Game Science, this Souls-like game features impressive scale and visuals. Set for release on August 20th, 2024, Black Myth explores a vast world, blending elements of horror, action, and immersive storytelling. Drawing inspiration from games like Sekiro, it presents a unique take on the action RPG genre. Entering the top three, we find ourselves excited about Hades 2. Developed by Supergiant Games, known for their exceptional titles like Bastion and Transistor, Hades 2 promises to expand upon the success of its predecessor. Shifting the focus to the immortal princess of the underworld, this sequel introduces new characters, challenges, and locations. 
Set for early access in Q2 2024, Supergiant Games aims to deliver a bigger and deeper experience for fans. Coming in at second place, we've got Star Wars Outlaws, a groundbreaking single-player third-person action-adventure set between The Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi. Developed by Massive Entertainment and Ubisoft, it offers a unique take on the Star Wars universe, zooming in on the underworld. Take on the role of the rogue scoundrel K. Vess. Star Wars Outlaws marks the debut of the first-ever open-world Star Wars game, unfolding between The Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi in the Star Wars timeline. Get ready to meet K. Vess, a scoundrel navigating the galactic underworld in an attempt to survive. The main story follows Kay as she endeavors to execute one of the biggest heists in the Outer Rim, all while dodging the Empire, Syndicates, and her own haunted past. Kay aims to use the spoils from the heist to start anew, but in the Star Wars universe, that's always easier said than done. Topping our list at number one is Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Get ready for an epic gaming experience with Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. This action role-playing game, developed and published by Square Enix, is set to hit PlayStation 5 on February 29th, 2024. It's the sequel to the highly acclaimed Final Fantasy VII Remake 2020, and the second installment in a trilogy that revamps the classic 1997 PlayStation game. Just like its predecessor, the gameplay seamlessly blends real-time action with strategic and role-playing elements. Dive into the adventure immediately after the events of the remake, where you'll take control of the mercenary Cloud Strife and lead a party of characters from the eco-terrorist group Avalanche. Together, they embark on a mission across the planet to stop the megacorporation Shinra from exploiting the life essence, known as the life stream, as an energy source. Their ultimate goal? Defeat the formidable former elite soldier Sephiroth, who aims to unite with the planet for even greater power. That concludes our list of the top 10 most anticipated games of 2024. Keep an eye on these titles as they promise to deliver immersive experiences, pushing the boundaries of storytelling and gameplay. And don't forget to subscribe. It means the world to me.